someone in this building has betrayed their country. If you are found to have withheld information, you will be charged with a breach of the Official Secrets Act. Catherine Gunn, who do you think might have leaked the Coterie email? I was shocked, I was angry, um, I was disgusted, and, um, and it immediately was like um, a red flag to me that I had to expose it and reveal it to the public. I think ultimately I did believe from the very beginning that this was what it said it was. There are good people working within all governments. Um, the trouble is, as we've discovered in our own personal journeys, if you like, is that the good people often aren't heard. I hope that the film demonstrates that this isn't a simple black and white case, that there aren't just lots of baddies and goodies out there. You're a spy. You work for the British government. No, I work for the British people. I do not collect information so that the government can lie to the British people. I did go home and think about it over the weekend and I contacted the person who I eventually gave it to and then I went in on Monday to work and printed it off and took it out of the building, posted it. So it was pretty instant. When you're dealing with whistleblowers, you don't really make that kind of judgment. You're, you're trying to keep the information as pure as possible. Mm. But I think objectively now we can, all of us, see that this was an extraordinary act.